gotta skin them and stuff. You like my camera bag? Okay. My buddy steals his purse from his wife to go hunting. <laughs> the young boys are gonna run up the bloody mountain. Yep. And run back down. It's day three of our elk hunt. Mark is spending the day in the ground blind where the salt lake used to be before it was hijacked. I've never been to this area, and I'm looking forward to exploring some new country. This country is gorgeous. I can't believe how good it feels to be outside, away from the city. Since my wife's cancer diagnosis, I haven't been able to shake the dread that comes with such news. But somehow, on this day, on this morning, I just feel hopeful. For the first time in weeks, I'm not just feeling afraid that my wife is going to die from cancer. The sun is out, I'm in God's country, and all I feel is blessed. A bit tired, yeah, but happy though because we're seeing animals, right? We're seeing. I want to kill my first bull. I thought you guys were gonna kill a bull. Yeah, what do you got there for dinner? Be stroking off. Beef stroganoff. That just doesn't sound good to me. It's 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 like I swear you're gonna make us you're gonna make this tent stink tonight. <coughs> Deny it. Deny <laughs> it. I need to choke me because I laugh. <laughs> Chad and I hiked up to the the meadow up there last for a while we spotted a doe and a fawn yeah yeah running around and uh, just on the edge of the field which is pretty cool and then uh just watched her for a little bit saw her bolt multiple times throughout the afternoon and then um we did some calling just a little calling routine to see if we could get anything to come in silently mm -hmm. but uh there was nothing there so the next thing we we started to hike out the field and we were skirting the edge of the field how big was it and this three-point bull was just sit, sitting right in the middle of the field which is pretty cool he's just parked right there he's just eating grass you know and so i don't know we we weren't sure he was kind of right in the middle of the field like not where we could get to him about 100 yards i wasn't going to take that shot yeah because i've seen it it's wide open eh? 
yeah. So we ended up moving. Uh, I stepped back, started bugling a little bit, and calling to see if just cow calling a little bit, really, yeah. doing some some stuff to see if I could get him to just come 30 yards closer, you know, right. 40 yards closer, just something to give Chad a, a chance. And uh, so I dropped back and started calling. It was getting pretty dark. But uh, he just never showed any interest. He just kind of ignored our calls. Nothing at all, eh? Yeah. And uh, so we, we ended up just kind of sneaking out of there and leaving. But I don't know. It was it was a good, uh, it was a long day. A lot of hiking. Checking out new country, you know. But it was a good sign. We saw great, him. Though, eh? Yeah, it was a good sign. You know, it was fun. It was beautiful country. Beautiful. So I'm just looking forward to get some sleep. It was cool. Good. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Another day. Good night. Mm -hmm.